really need to spend $22 to get a nice liquid black liner? I don't know. I'm trying it so that you guys don't have to. So today, let's review Fenty Beauty's Black Fly Liner and put it against ColourPop's $8 BFF Liner to see which one is the clear winner. Let's try it out. First, let's do ColourPop. I mean, immediately it feels really nice against the lid and there's a lot of pigment coming out. I like it. I have no complaints. I have no complaints. Now let's do Fenty in the other eye and see if there's a difference. Okay, immediately I would say that this has a thinner point, but it feels almost identical to ColourPop in the sense that it feels like a paintbrush. It's a good liner. Can you see a difference? Let's add some mascara. Okay, so my mascara is on. Can you see a difference? I can't. <laughs> there is no distinguishable difference between these two products. They both felt nice against my skin. They both had a paintbrush tip. They both gave me a lot of pigment and they even have the same finish. Save your money, get the $8 ColourPop one, you can spend $22 on a liner, but you don't need to. I hope that this helped. My next video, I'm actually gonna review Fenty Beauty's Brown Fly Liner. I'm curious how it's gonna hold up. It's a milk chocolate color, which I haven't seen in a liquid liner before. I'm excited, so stay tuned for that.